Hello everybody, it's your boy Zion here back again with another gameplay video for you guys today and today I'm gonna be playing with you Rider again with Julek and another special guest Katana Blackwolf. Hey guys again. <laughs> Salutations mortals. Yeah, now this is part two of our Would You Rather series, and what you guys have to say, what do you like to say at the, before we start, Julek? Other than um, giving you support, Vegito, uh, just check out just check out in the description about my YouTube channel if you guys want to check it out. It's up to you. And uh, make sure you support both Katana and uh, Vegito here. That's all I can say. Oh, thanks, Jolot. No what problem. What do you have to say to Katana? Well, I kind of find it puzzling of how this game of Would You Rather actually works. But, thus indeed, mortals, if you ever do like have the time be sure you support mr julik here and his friend to their channels give them some good love because they do real good videos and let's just have a good time with this that's all i can say yeah and like looks like we have your first question who wants to read it first i'll go ahead let's see we got would you rather drink only water and alcohol for the rest of your life or drink anything other than alcohol for the rest of your life. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let you two answer this first. Like I would pick drink anything other than alcohol for the rest of your for the rest of my life. Yeah, I can I can see why because IRL you're a minor. <laughs> I would agree on this too because other than drinking alcohol. It can really damage your lungs and not in a very good way. That could cause people's bodies to collapse easily. And considering how people want to neglect their diet, it just really doesn't seem as accurate. But drinking other things like cranberry juice, milk, or orange juice, they do give good vitamins. So I would prefer that. Yeah, but other than that, uh, if you ever just want to like laze, laze around and all that, just watching TV with your family or uh, just, just all that, you can just drink like uh, sodas, again, like Katana said, cranberry juice and all that. So, I mean, drinking, al drinking alcohol is pretty much how adults handle it because they just like to do their, their partying and everything. So, but other than that, we need to keep in control of that one. So keep y'all in mind on that one if you're gonna drink some alcohol in parties. So I'm gonna yeah. have to, yeah. So I'm gonna agree with the both of you on this one. Yeah, I mean alcohol is bad, and wow. seventy-four percent agree with us. We won that. I'll take it. Wow, color me impressed. I guess the mortals really do have good common sense when it comes to keep keeping themselves healthy. Aside yeah. from the I am very well pleased. Beast. Aside from the twenty six percent on this one. No. <laughs> 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 uh, anyways, let's just move on. Yeah. If you were, if you were a musician, would you rather be Eddie Vedder or Freddie Mercury? I would honestly be Freddie Mercury because I'm a big fan of the Queen. Yeah. Um, same here. All right, guys. I'm just gonna be real with y'all. I do not know both of these these people. Okay, I, okay, I'm, I can't lie to you. I don't know Eddie Vedder, so I I only go to Freddie Mercury because, like I already mentioned, I'm a big fan. Please. <laughs> All right, you know, you know, since I don't know both of them, I'm just gonna go with Freddie. All right. Yeah, same here. The next Katana. No, wow. I agreed. I agreed. A lot oh. better than the last one. Oh, wow! We both we all won that again. Well, what can we say? Freddie Mercury is the best one. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna read the next question. All right, you go ahead. Would you rather be muscular with a busted face or be busted with a gorgeous face? Busty. Oh, I said that wrong. Yeah, you wanna be busted with a gorgeous face, I see. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> nah, I'm but, kidding. Yeah, but if I have to be honest, I would rather be 
busty with a gorgeous face. That's what I just said, man. Hmm. Yeah, what are you guys gonna pick? Well, in my universe, I've been around people with muscular bodies, but with busted faces, so it's really not my style. But I would prefer to be the one with the gorgeous face rather than just looking ugly because it's not my type. Yeah, pretty sure no one wants to be ugly except Baraka. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and who is this Baraka you speak of? Let's just say he's no he's known as a Tarkatan, a being from oh. another realm. Ooh. Hmm. I yeah, would like to they... meet this one. Barkata. Yeah, uh I think that I think I think that will be happening in the next video, Katana. Alright. Very well. Well, it depends. Right. It depends, cause he's too ugly to show people around. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so I'll agree with the both with the both of you on this one. Be busty and with a gorgeous face. Cause I don't want to be a Tarkatan in this one. All right, let's see. Oh, we won seventy-four percent. At this point, we're just going for red at this at this video. It yeah, seems we can like it. Up a bit. All right, All right uh, next Katana. Question. Katana, would you like to read this one? Hmm. Okay. <clears throat> if you like to kill one of these two, would you rather kill Abraham Lincoln so that slavery still existed, or kill George Washington so that we lost the American Revolution? Hmm. Ouch. This is a horrible question. That uh, was a, this is messed up even from the last question from part one. No comment. Yeah, no comment. You well, know, in my opinion, I can I can do say that I've did some ancient history on these two who used to be someone that they call presidents and they've been fighting for rights of freedom. So if I had to choose between one or the other, I would prefer to kill hmm, Abraham Lincoln. You know, I... I play the fifth. Yeah, well, I I actually follow Katana on this one because uh, you might you might all already know I'm from Planet Vegeta and I kind of learned a few things about Earth uh, thanks to a certain friend of mine who's actually my yeah, brother. Yeah, playing the fifth. Yeah, I actually don't know about this one. Uh, they yeah. may seem a bit brutal, but. You know, knowing that if you had to kill either one or the other, it still wouldn't make sense regardless. Yeah, you, yeah. Yeah, you do have a point. So wait, Vegito, which one did you pick again? I said I played the fifth. Oh, okay. Uh screw it, why not? I'll just I'll just kill George Washington. The one dollar bill man. <laughs> or so as or so as Earthlings say. Oh, yeah, I've been known around the Earthlings, but they're pretty nice. I am very, very disappointed. Wow, Katana lost that one. Yeah, this is pretty much how the game rolls, Katana. Hmm, <sighs> maybe so. I'll let this one slide, since I am still new to this. Yeah, we, we should not anger the goddess. Fairly certain I'm no one does. Moving on. Yeah, yeah, she, she can destroy us with a flick and bite. I'll read this one. Go ahead. If you were to participate in the Olympics, would you rather be in the Summer Olympics or be in the Winter Olympics? Yeah, this is a Summer. tough choice. This is a tough choice because I I did watch Earth Earth Olympics and they're both pretty interesting. When it comes to this, when it comes to summer, you can do like all kinds of Olympic things like like athletic. Um, uh, swimming and all that. And it's rather odd that, they, that these earthlings are riding on these horses. Yeah, uh, that's why I go with summer because I like the heat. Yeah. Hmm. Well, there are some, yeah. Well, there are some people who like the winter because of the snow. Well, I would not prefer the winter cold because that kind of icy chill kind of makes my tail 
very shaky, so I would prefer to be in the Summer Olympics. Yeah, I think, yeah, I think I would. I think I'm gonna prefer the Winter Olympics because who knows? Maybe you could you could do like all these kinds of Earth tricks, like no, like knowing some new things. You know what I mean? Uh, we're striking things up. All right. Sounds intriguing. And I lost. Aha! Wait. Yeah, we won. Haha. <laughs> Well, I can't be mad about that. Olympics are Olympics. I saw his earthlings say. Indeed. It sounds like these earthlings are more of a wiser people than the ones in my universe. Yeah, I've been studying them, and they, they are wiser. Some some of them. Yeah, be, yeah, most of the people believe that they're at the center of the universe. Anyways. Alright, alright. Um... Alright, off the topic of that, like, on the topic of that, alright, first of all, I'm gonna read that question, and secondly, some people, I mean, if you've been going off comic books, or, like, TV shows, I mean, sometimes the Earth is the center of everything that just ever lives, I mean, humans created, like, some superheroes, like, from comics to TV shows. Yeah, but there are some, there are some things that don't really go that way, know what I mean? Because there are some, because there are some certain things that humans make that clearly attempts to destroy the planet. Hmm. Then I shall find these humans and be rid of them so that they, they won't cause any more chaos than they already have. Well, they already cause a lot of chaos because of some disease that has been spreading around the surf. I think it was called, you know, what, just from no copyright thing. I think it was called. COVID. Hmm. Yeah, I've, yeah, I've heard, I've heard that these, that this kind of virus would be the worst, because I've seen so many Earthlings just perish because of that virus. Yeah, it, it occurred to me that like one million had died. Hmm. Bro. Yeah. Moving on. Let's just let's just continue the game. Oh yeah, I'll read this one. When addressing a person, would you rather begin every sentence with I'ma let you finish or end every sentence with embed? As this devil named Angel Dust would say, hmm, kinky. We, okay, okay. We're, we're not in Haslan Hotel. We're not even in hell. Well, I'm sorry. I had, I had a story in hell. I do not want to hmm. talk about it. Oh, this yeah, angel does Charlie. sounds like a person with evil deeds that I would not approve of. No, it's not like it's not like he's evil, Katana. Let's just say he's um. Yo, yo, let's not tell her. Let's just just keep it our little secret. Uh, fine. What was yeah, that? All right, Katana, Katana. All right, here's where we're gonna sit. Okay, I met Charlie. She was good and all. I mean, I could go to hell and to the real world back, but she was actually trying to get one, just trying to prove that any demon can get rehabilitated into going to this, going into heaven. I mean, you're a god of, you're the goddess of destruction, so is that possible? Hmm. Well, not every being would want to think of rehabilitating somebody who has already done a bad deed. But I don't think it's possible. Every good deed goes unpunished. No matter how much you try to redeem yourself, the results will still end up being the same. There's no redeeming of what it's already done. It doesn't work like that. Wow, that is just the exact same thing Alistair told me. Yeah, I was about to point this out. And if you want to know who this Alistair is, Katana, one, he is known as a radio demon, one of the strongest demons in hell, and... Let's just say he and I have a history in hell. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, right. Okay. Get, okay. Get it. Okay. Getting back in the in the game, I would actually prefer with beginning with every sentence with "I'ma let you finish" because in the ending, the every sentence with "in bed," it sounds wrong in some yeah, way. Yeah, I'm gonna have to. I would have to agree. I mean, yes, why, I agree as well. Wow. 
That is some bull, and you guys know it. Why would you? Oh, oh you oh, mortals oh. disgust me. <laughs> yeah, they're, they, they're just making it dirty. Oh my god, no. Yeah. Well, it is what it is. All right, Katana. All right, let's. Katana, you can read the next question. Very well. Would you rather reach your ideal salary or reach your ideal weight? Salary. Hmm. Salary. I don't have any problems with my weight because my weight stays constant. I don't eat, barely. But, but I would prefer to keep an ideal salary, which is always fair. Yeah, I'd agree with the both of you on that one. Yeah, so, um, Katana, I hear that you, in, in your universe, you've been dating Goku. How's that work now? <clears throat> well, I, I mean, he, he has been there for me, and I really truly do love him. But especially when someone tries to take him from me, I will have to... <clears throat> yeah, I get what, I get what you're going there, Katana. I've been down that road. I mean, not with a Goku yeah. part, of course. Have you not? Sorry for bringing it up, but let's continue. Yeah, but other than so that, sorry. I do. Yeah, but other than that, I do feel your pain, Katana. So yeah, I I hmm. agree with. I At agree least with you understand, mortal. Okay, I find that hurtful, to be honest, because I came from the realm of the gods, to be honest. Oh, so you're a god? Well, I'm basically half god. Well, I'm technically well, I'm technically a. Demigod, because I do not have the full blood of a god. My yeah. apologies. Yeah, I mean, I, I'm basically a demigod too, because we do have, like, in my form, I do have a super insane god form, but sometimes I can go beyond the gods, but not all the time. Yeah. I see. Yeah, in case, in case, you're, in case you're not familiar with this, um, Goku from our universe or as we like to call him, Kakarot. He he reached this form, which which reached the realm of the gods. They call it Super Saiyan God, to challenge the God of Destruction, Beerus, from Universe 7. Hmm. Lord Beerus. I have heard of him. It's been quite a long time. I haven't seen him since one million years. That's how long everything has gone by. Let's just say, let's just say the real reason why, um, how Goku was able to reach Super Saiyan God was because of a certain pudding trouble. Hmm. Lord That's Beerus does have a tendency to get upset over something so small. For when your planet does acquire every interesting artifact of foods, so to speak. Don't we all? Yeah. Sometimes we do. Alright, so what are you guys gonna pick? But we all agree on salary. Indeed. Yeah. All right. I saw that coming. Sixty-nine. <laughs> Hooray. Yeah, I saw that coming. All right. Okay. So Next let's question. just let's just do three more questions before we end the video. Yeah. Okay. So Katana, would you like to read this one? Of course. Would you rather be deep sea diving and your oxygen tank runs out, or bungee jumping and have your court snap? Bruh. Well, I'm going with bungee jumping. Well, so most you're... people are more like bungee jumping in the one place where it's like very distant, wide open, and it's like a very far, far place to what? fall. I would not prefer to bungee jump, but I would rather skydive. Well, deep. sea diving, so to speak. Deep sea diving. Yeah. yeah, I would rather I would rather go to the deep sea as well because I'm actually familiar I'm actually familiar with it a lot. Because of um let's just say I met I can breathe say, underwater. Yeah, let's yeah, just say it yeah, let's just say I met this friend of mine from um, a mystical kingdom and um she offered me a special pendant, which could help me allow to control the water. So I would have no problem when coming into the deep sea. 
All right. Hey, Sounds guys, interesting. We have to hurry this up. I'm on a time limit, and we have five minutes left, so I bet I think we have to hurry this up. Yeah, that's why it's just said we got like three more questions. Jim. Wow. And I won that. Hooray! Hooray for me! Suck it. Hmm. These oh. mortals. Well, uh, we can't control them every time, Katana. That's the issue with them. Yeah. I'm basically in my prime before I'm full. I'm basically suppressed before going primal form. Well, my original form, as so Saiyans would like to call it, Super Saiyan 4. Uh, wait a minute, Katana. Have you been recently with Super Saiyan 4? Uh, uh, I mean, well, well, I, uh, I, I have, I have, yes. <clears throat> oh. What makes you ask that question? Um, I don't know, because... Maybe he only... Maybe he... You've been having a fun time with that. Uh, who, who told you that? I'm guessing it's this guy named Vegeta. Yes. Oh. Yeah, you told me the same. I've heard Until of it. him. After this, I will have to go over to his place and he will get Hakai'd. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, Katana, you need to be careful on that because Vegeta is training under me. We're actually, I'm actually training him to achieve a new form he and Kakarot are seeking. Hmm. Moving, right. Yeah, moving on. I'll read this one. Would you rather live in? All right. Would you rather live in? Would you rather Tokyo or Hong Kong? I think I would rather live in Tokyo because I've heard they have this these interesting stuff in it, especially when it yeah. comes to their food, which yeah, I've heard. Yeah, I would rather live in Tokyo too because that is a great place. Anything you got to say about hmm. this? Katana? I would actually want to live in Tokyo too. Because I do know a little bit of Japanese there. Yeah. yeah. Pretty much mo pretty much the three of us do. Yeah, alright. Yeah, so... We won! Wow! Only With an only by overwhelming margin of 83%. Yeah, and they had 70 for Hong Kong. Wow. Yeah. Okay, I can't lie to the two of you. I kind of su saw this coming because... I'm pretty sure they love a lot. They love Tokyo a lot more. Yeah, I mean, all right. There's one. There's like the one reason. I mean, I have five, but one reason that I love Tokyo is that those shows are never canceled. Yeah, that's all I've heard. Okay, we got one more question before we end the video, and hopefully this doesn't go as bad as the last one. Yeah. Let's hope yeah. not. I'll read it. Would you rather be married to someone who is a know-it-all or very ignorant? A know-it-all. Hmm. A know-it-all indeed. Because I would never want to be married to someone who is very ignorant. Like, like Vegeta. I was about to point that one out, Katana. <laughs> hmm. Because um, I've heard he has this ignorant tone when it comes to just being with his lover, Boma, until he moved on. Yes, but yeah, he keeps bringing up his pride and how he is claimed to be the prince of all Saiyans when his entire race was blanked from existence. Yeah, I overheard that Lord Beerus was the one who was responsible for his own planet's destruction, am I correct? Yeah. Yeah, ooh, yeah, ooh. yeah, I heard that from Broly and Paragus, like, they, Frieza told them that, like, they ordered Lord Beerus, Lord Beerus ordered Frieza to destroy the planet, so, they only told him on the loadout and just keep it like, they don't remember it. Yeah, and I'm just, and I can't, and I don't want to be that guy, but, um, Vegeta still remains having that title because the, the planet Vegeta has been repopulated instead. Alright guys, um, I think you have to end it there, so can we click on it? Yeah, sorry about that. So we all agree on a know-it-all. Yeah. yeah. Yes. Okay, wow. Alright, so- And we won. 
All right, yes. thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys like, subscribe, press the notification bell, and subscribe to the subscribe to their channels. And what do you have to say before we go? First, Katana. Thank you. Well, mortals, as I said before, be sure you give these two some love and hit that notification bell, like and subscribe to their channels, and don't forget to comment down below what you guys want to do next, or you will get hakkaid. Okay, let's not get carried away, Katana. But anyway, yeah, but anyways, Earthlings, make sure, like Katana said, to make sure to give Vegito the love and support he said he gets, and respect the goddess here, Katana. And uh, one more thing I gotta mm -hmm. say, um, Vegeta, if you're ever watching this video, all I gotta tell you, watch your back. Because trust me, literally some people here, well not in this video, but some other people outside, are clearly coming after you. Don't ask how, don't ask who, that I've been told about that. <laughs> yeah. Hmm.